Libra. You like traveling and exploring different cultures. The year's first quarter will not be favorable for a long or short trip. Mars will be in retrogression during the first month, so it will be better if you avoid any travel plans. If you are very particular about any trip, then you should have back plans. Being an air sign, you cannot stay in one place for a long time, and you get bored if you do so. So, you will be making some plans for long trips. May to June will be ideal for long trips, and you will have vacations too. Transfer and other short trips will be coming in November and December. So, this is a very action-packed year regarding travel for Libra rising, sun and the moon. Scorpio This is a very good year for traveling opportunities. You can expect long and short travels, but kindly avoid traveling during the Mercury retrogression phase. There will be many opportunities for foreign travel as Jupiter will be in the sign of foreign travel for a long time. The month of June and November can bring some opportunities for long-distance travel. Throughout the year, there are chances for traveling, but January and February will project opportunities for foreign travel. Sagittarius The transit of nodes will be very important and it will be showing some chances for long trips. You naturally have a lot of wanderlust. Your travel plans will get materialized during this time. Saturn will be aspecting the travel house throughout the year, so you will have many plans for long trip and foreign travels too. Jupiter transit also will bring work-wise foreign collaborations and foreign travels. Short trips also will be the bigger part of in this year. February to March will be ideal for relocation and a travel with the family. Work-related transfer also will be coming up. Some long trips can also come in May to June. July to August will be the strongest period for long trips. <laughs>